everybody, Will here, and welcome back to Resident Evil 4. We survived the onslaught of Las Plagas Possessed Farmers in the first part, and we're just continuing where we left off. I'm going to go ahead and start this part by uh, breaking this box. They call me uh, Leon S. Boxbreaker. That's my, that's my wrestler name. <laughs> watch out, watch out, watch out! But in all seriousness, if you guys are enjoying watching me play these games, drop a like and a subscribe. The support is greatly appreciated. It is terribly hard getting a YouTube channel, especially a gaming channel, off the ground. In all honesty, it's a little exhausting. I do, uh, I have a full-time job, and I also go to school. Um, it's, it's a nightmare. But, hey, I do play these games because I enjoy it. It's an excellent way to distress. I get to get some gaming on, and hopefully you guys get to watch some awesome content because I do try my best to make these videos. So drop a like and a subscribe. It's greatly appreciated. And uh, let's start this part by, I don't know what we're going to do first. We're just going to continue on. Here we go. There's nothing in that box. That's okay. Ooh, we got some eggs. That's always good. Here we go. Oh, <gasps> we got a golden chicken egg. Hell yeah. We're not going to use that quite yet. <laughs> we're going to, I don't know, consume that down the road. Um... What do we got? About the blue medallions. Fifteen blue medallions, seven in the farm, eight in the cemetery. For those of you who destroy ten or more, will be rewarded. Awarded. Yeah, I feel like you should have put rewarded. The rest is illegible. That's okay. I think I remember where these uh, emblems are. There's one right here. We're just gonna go ahead and shoot that. What'd you call me? We're gonna start the uh, the assault. Oh, no, we're not, because I had to reload my gun. <laughs> Knife you until you die. You know, I was, uh, I was looking at a list of uh, the strongest weapons in all Resident Evil games. And Leon's knife in this game actually came out being one of the top weapons. I mean, everybody's used it, right? It's uh, infinite ammo. It's, 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 it's strong. You know, it does a fair amount of damage. I think uh, the base damage for the, uh, the knife is pretty much about the same as uh, this first pistol you get. It does about the same damage as the pistol, so I'm just gonna shoot this guy because we don't need his nonsense. Kick! Kicking knife. How do those axes stay on their pants? Yeah, I'm gonna get more handgun ammo. We're gonna do some looting. Looty tunes. Actually, speaking of looty tunes, what do you guys think about Space Jam? New Legacy, or whatever it's called. Have you guys seen it yet? I haven't. Uh, I don't know if I am going to see it because I'm a... Uh... Oh, man, I grew up with the, the first one, right? Michael Michael Jordan. Hey, man, what's up? <laughs> hey, fall to your knees. There we go. I want to get a good kick in. You know Leon doesn't skip leg day. It's all about that leg action. Actually, Leon sure does use his legs a lot in this game. Most of the action sequences involves him swimming or running or doing some kind of leg work. He's got the frog legs. Alright, I think there's one more guy roaming around here. And here's another one of these things. Nice. We're going to try to get them all because if you, you, know, if, if you hit the minimum amount of them, you, you get the, the Punisher, I think. Or maybe not the Punisher. You, you get a free gun. Oh, I suck at this. Hey, there we go. You get a free gun. Uh, but uh, if you get all of the uh, emblems, not only do you get a free gun, but it, it has it's like upgraded. So we're we're gonna go ahead and try to do that. All right, now we're gonna shoot this down. Uh, because if you guys didn't know, if you want this pearl pendant to uh, you know come out like regular. Uh, you have to shoot that little 2x4 that's holding the lid up. Otherwise, if you shoot the pendant down, it's going to fall into dirty water, and it's it's not going to be worth the jack. Ooh. Hopefully we can get some shotgun shells. Uh, I don't know if we've already gotten shotgun shells. We were pretty much out of shotgun ammo after that first encounter. So we may be out of luck, because I want to get the beer steam. Yeah, it's right there, and I, I I don't know if you can uh, destroy the the dresser that's covering it with uh, with the handgun. I think you have to do it 
with the I think you have to do it with the uh, shotgun but we'll find out it's right here I don't know if we've gotten shotgun ammo that's the map uh, we did get shotgun ammo and we got exactly the amount we need to destroy this I mean I suppose you can also use grenade or the incendiary grenade but we're gonna save those usually takes three shotgun shells to destroy this bad boy. I heard something running. Was that me? No, it is me. Okay. The footsteps literally sound like they're coming for something else. So, all right. Yellow. We're going to climb this uh, ladder in here, and we're going to try to find the other... Uh, there, there's two more emblems, right? There's two more emblems I got to find in this area. We're gonna take the handgun ammo. Uh, we already got that one. So there's one on the little windmill thing out here. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, you see there's one right here. Moving ever so slowly. Got it. And there's another one over there, uh, which we're gonna go ahead and go get. And I think that's all the emblems in this area. There's eight more in the cemetery. I think I remember where all those are. Hey! There we go! I got it! Man, I'm gonna be out of ammo soon. I got... I got... That's the map. I really gotta stop pushing X and, uh, you know, get used to pushing the plus sign for the map. Okay. I'm gonna do a little bit of organization here, because you guys know how I operate. At this point, hopefully. Look at Leon, though, whenever he equips the egg. Yeah... He's ready. It kind of looks like a golden potato, doesn't it? Alright, here we go. Oh, I have, shit, I have the uh, egg equipped. I don't want to waste it. It acts kind of like a full restore, uh, if, you know, even if you're in red. By the way, I love the egg icon right there at the bottom right. It, <laughs> like, it's cracked, but it looks pretty cool. Kind of looks like a Digimon egg. Or a Pokemon egg, whatever. Uh, whatever floats your boat. Okay, we got the infamous boulder scene coming up, so I'm gonna get the handgun ready. Alright, I'm also gonna take a sip of my beverage here. Oh man, that's good. If you guys can hear that, that knocking sound, that's Luis. <laughs> you can hear him in that little cabinet thing all the way from over here. Oh, I'm so ready for this. I was born ready. My thumbs are like Superman's thumbs. Oh. Ooh. Oh. That part always puts me on edge. But we made it. We didn't die. So that's good. Uh, there's some spinels, spinels up here. Got it. <laughs> I'm going to take that spinel. And there's another one right here. And these, these fools, these fools up here have dynamite. Uh, I think you can nail that guy right there, actually. Let's try. Oh, no, I shot him in the face. Oh, well, he's not going to be too happy. Okay, I seriously thought you can shoot the dynamite from here. Or does he have to light it? Does he have to light it first? Let's try it. Oh, no, that's not good. Go again. Throw it again. Ha I think I even got the guy on the inside right there. That's perfect. That is great. And while we're at it, we're going to shoot the... Uh... There we go. Let's see if we can nail this guy from over here. <laughs> That's a weird sound. If you get shot and you go... Ooh, Shit. Hey, how about you not lob uh, dynamite at me? Whoa! How did you guys even get dynamite anyways? Story behind that. Excavation in the ruins? Haha! <laughs> and that's how you do it, baby. We got a spinel. That's a cute little spider. Have you seen the Black Widow movie, guys? I have. It's amazing. I like it. It's a welcome addition to the uh, Marvel Universe. Marvel Cinematic Universe. You guys not lob shit at me, please? I don't want to do any gameplay right now. 
Got it. Got a red cat's eye. We can already put that in the beer stein. Stein? Beer stein. Alright. Let's see if we can get this dude. You in there? Oh, I dare you to throw that at. I dare you. Come on. <laughs> That's so great. Oh, man. They implemented quite a bit of action in this game. No clues here. There's a grenade. There we go. Uh, they implemented quite a quite a bit of action in here with the quick time events. Uh, so, you know, that was definitely really cool. I, I remember that's what blew my mind the first time I played this game. It's so uh, so much more different compared to the first uh, first few Resident Evil games. It's kind of like an investigative survival horror. This one's you know full of action. Not that that's a bad thing. I mean, I really like it. Oh nope, I want to shoot that, and then there's another one in there. We ain't falling for no traps today, guys. We're veterans. We are Resident Evil 4 veterans. Okay, 1,000. We're just going to move this thing out of the way. And we're going to have our first encounter with Luis. Sarah. You see that? He's right in there. We're going to go ahead and let him out, guys. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Click. Think? No. <clears throat> You're not like them? Not yet. No. <laughs> you? <clears throat> okay. I have only one very important. Man, I love Luis. He's great. You got a smoke? Got gum. <laughs> oh, then we got these guys and the head honcho with the big Perfect. cheese. The big cheese. What? Oh, he big. Look at that beard. You see? You see, that's what I was talking about. The leg thing. Leon uses his legs so much in this game. And by the way, why would you just straight up, if you have a gun, why would you straight up run at somebody like that? And that dude is twice your size, Leon. What are you doing, bro? Okay. I think we're going to end this here. Uh, this is going to be part two of the Let's Play Resident Evil 4 Uh upload series on my channel if you guys are enjoying this drop a like and a subscribe it's greatly appreciated i will see you all in the next part and until then have a wonderful day